everybody, this is Watch Us Play. I'm Joey Davidson alongside... Michael White. There he is. And we are playing Race the Sun. Mm -hmm. So, Mike, how much do you know about this game? Uh, next to nothing. Oh, good. Just watching you play, that's really... The extent of it? It's uh, named after a Doors song. Or also, uh, that, that movie about the, uh, the team of science students in Hawaii who built a solar-powered car. Oh, I don't know if it's actually named after a Doors song. Oh, well, it is actually, I don't know if it is actually named out of that movie, but it is, it is basically that movie with striking similarities, so I don't know if they did that on purpose or not. Huh. Uh, this game was developed by Flipfly, it's a really tiny indie studio, and it was originally a, a, like a Shockwave Flash game um, that released on Congregate, that like gaming platform. Yep. Yeah. And it's an endless racer, um, except you might be looking at this and thinking like, oh man, the world must be procedurally generated. Well, it is, but it is on a 24-hour cycle. So the world that I'm playing today will be the same all day long uh, until tomorrow when it's new. Huh. So you are a solar-powered craft, uh, which is, i.e., racing the sun. Oh, God! Racing the sun. Um, and you see those lights on, on my back? There's like four of them in the center. Yeah. If those deplete because I'm in the shadow or because the sun is actually gone on its path of setting, I will crash. And, oh, not crash, but just like stall out, run right. out of energy, um, and the run will thus be over. So basically, it's just like a really addictive, endless racer that has like this nice visual timer up in the top there. Um, and you also pick up power-ups, and I'm still very early in the game, but as you level, you pick up more power-ups, and you pick up those these little blue guys that are dropping down. Those are score boosters. Hmm. Oh, God, that was terrible. <laughs> and then this yellow thing pushes the sun back up in the sky a little bit higher. So that's how you stay ahead. Um, oh, God, and that is what crashing looks like. <laughs> So you can, uh, I mean, can you upgrade your ship? Can you? Yep. Can it's you... it's a lot like a, and I hate to compare it this way because I'm really not a fan of mobile games, but it's a lot like a mobile game in the sense that, um, I think maybe Jetpack Joyride, right? As you progress through that game, you actually add stuff to Barry Steak Fries' ensemble to make him better at running, right? right. So eventually right. you're upgrading your ship, but you're not taking away the challenge of the game because the challenge of the game, as you can see, is dodging shit at high speeds. <laughs> Um, so if anything, you'll get faster, which will just make it harder. Right, or right now I have this magnetic thing which pulls these uh, these little power-ups and stuff a little bit closer to me at a faster clip. Um, so far, I'm having a lot of fun with it. It's, it's you know, normally when we do these watch this play sessions, uh, Mike will come in and I will have to start the game up. I think this is the first time that you've ever actually seen me walked in and you were just sitting here playing it, going, in there deep. Da -da. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's 10 bucks right now. They do have it on Steam Greenlight, so you can only buy it directly from the developer. And I think it's a technically it's a humble bundle transaction. Okay. Um, but you can only buy it from the developer, and we've included that link in the post for this video on Crave Online. Or you can vote for it on Steam Greenlight, um, and that will maybe get the. I can't get up there. God, I don't know what to do. <laughs> um, upgrade. Upgrade complete. Oh, don't, oh. Girlfriend, don't worry. Are we, so we're going to go until this run is over. How's that taste? Yeah. You know, this reminds me a little bit of, uh, and again, this is another bad comparison, but um, Nitronic Rush was a game developed by DigiPen students. Mm -hmm. uh, I think you, did you show me that game? I can't remember. I think I, we all found it collectively on Reddit. Okay. Uh, but anyway, you know, just like a, a kind of old school arcade racing game, very challenging, kind of like a survival racing game. You're, it's just single player. You don't, there's not even like an AI to race against mm -hmm. for the most part, but just so much fun, like the art and the, I mean, the gameplay was just rock solid. It was a gorgeous looking game yeah. too. Um, this this is kind of in the in the same vein. Like there's nothing there's nothing too complex happening here, but yeah. it's very simple. It's easy to pick up. Uh, you will get absolutely smashed your first couple of runs. <laughs> and when you're when you're starting out the game, you see these yellow beams that I'm picking up that pushes the sun up. Yeah. Uh, those don't exist for the first couple levels. So like you're just you're, they're just kind of like training you. Yeah. Um, what, do you like that little... Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's fun. I mean, like, I don't... When we review games, I'm typically in it until I'm done, and then I'm not playing it again for a long time. Uh, not that we're reviewing this game, but I find this very hard to put down, which is one of the, the highest compliments I can pay a game like Absolutely. an Endless Racer. Yeah. Um, oh, what's that? What's that? We got clouds now? Oh, boy. I think this is the furthest... 
I, I made it. The run that I had when you came in was pretty good. Okay, I'm not doing too bad here. So we're gonna keep on rolling until I die, Michael. I hope you know that. This could be a 45 minute long episode. <laughs> Something never before seen. Oh! oh! All right, so that's Race to Sun. And like we said, you can find it below. Oh, also, real quick, uh, if we wanted to play this together, so you own it and I own it. Yay, upgrade. Yay, tips. You see that share button on the left-hand side? Yeah. It flips to relay. I could send you the relay link. You could click it, or fire up your game, and you pick up where I left off. We oh do that gosh. four times, and that's a relay. <laughs> so it's kind of like, you know, passing the baton or whatever. Yeah. So this has been Race the Sun. Thank you guys for watching Watch Us Play, and we will be back next time with a brand new episode.